in this video we can study the next portion of module 4 that is sonnet bar sdh what do you mean by digital carrier system so it's a carrier system which is used to transmit voice signals over a high capacity transmission links such as optical fiber coaxial cable and microwave actually uh, this is a hierarchy of digital sig signals that is used mainly in telephone network and also it can used in trunks and access links then why we are using this digital hierarchy or digital signal servicing because we have to multiplex the data rates you can see in this figure we started from ds0 signals and we reach up to ds4 it's a system of hierarchy or signal of hierarchy here you can see that uh, actually it starts from 64 kbps but finally it reached at 1.53 mbps so for uh, multiplexing the data rates we are using this digital hierarchy or digital signal servicing mechanism okay next what is digital signal and itut standard actually these are the standards which are used for uh, digital signal transmission uh, over tdm multiplexing and this digital signal which is used in north american standard and itut standard which is used as international standard if you are using digit ds signal is carried over a carrier system then it is known as d carrier and uh, if you are using signal carried over this itut standard these are known as e carrier okay and this is the structure of ds1 signal hierarchy one signal which contains an FPET which is used in synchronization and it transmits the pattern 10101010 etc and which contains also 24 time slots and each time slot is one byte or eight bit okay and for every six successive time slot there will be a gap so equivalent to this uh, DS and ITUT standard for optical carry, um, transmission we are using the synchronous optical network and synchronous digital hierarchy that is sonnet and sdh actually this sonnet is developed by ansi and sdh was developed by itut okay actually the sonnet bar sdh which is equivalent to uh, ds and itut standards sonnet means it is synchronous optical network standard and uh, SDH means it's a synchronous digital hierarchy standard. So actually this sonnet encodes the bit streams uh, into an optical signal. They can be uh, propagated over optical fiber and it is mainly used for carrying many signals of different frequencies through a synchronous flexible and optical manner. And uh, in the sonnet and sdh standards we have three variations or uh, three um, types are the one is sts stm and oc standard the, actually this sts synchronous transport signal is the electrical side of sonnet and stm which is the electrical side of sdh and oc it is the optical side of sonnet bar sdh that is known as optical carrier so sts stm and oc all these are variation of or uh, sub standards of this sonnet bar sdh okay synchronous transport signal synchronous transport module and optical carrier so these are the sonnet bar sdh rates uh, you can see in this table sts and oc starts from uh, 1 to 192 but stm starts from 1 to 64 but it starts from the uh, rate 155 but for STS and OC1, you can see the lowest data rate is 51.8 and the highest data rate is 9953. But in the case of STM, you can see the lowest rate is uh, 155. Okay, this is the difference. And this is the structure of a sonnet frame. You can see 90 columns of one byte each and nine rows for one byte each so this is the structure of this frame which contains nine rows and 90 columns and each cell contains one byte one byte is equal to eight bit 
so it can transmit up to uh, 8000 frames per second also these bytes are transmitted one row at a time and first three columns of this STS one frame are section overhead and the remaining 87 columns are for synchronous uh, payload envelope SP includes 86 columns of the user data and one column of path overhead sorry so this is the structure of nine rows and 90 columns and the nine rows may, I mean, sorry first three columns which contain section and line overhead and the 87 remaining contains synchronous payload envelope in which 86 of user data okay so this overhead bytes are used by the sonnet equipment actually three overhead types are the section overhead line overhead and path overhead section and line overhead can, uh, is in uh, first three columns okay so this section overhead contains nine bits per uh, sorry nine bytes per frame including two framing bits plus other control information and line overhead also contains 18 bytes per frame and contains control information path overhead is actually a variable size its payload type and path status in okay it is uh, transmitted as part of uh, payload itself that is SP that is this path overhead is transmitted along with user data okay that is 87 columns which contains SP SP in which path overhead plus user data is the so this section overhead which connects actually to neighboring devices and line overhead which, uh, line overhead which connects to multiplexers and path overhead which connects to STS uh, multiplexer bar demultiplexer so these are all about the digital carrier system and sonnet bar sdh